Good morning, Darksiders. Dave H. Darkside Kennels. How's it going? So, um, we're having fun over here. We got two litters going on at the same time. I got the pockets in one room, and then I got the XLs in the other room. Um, I have no deposits on on the newborns yet on the XL litter. So, if somebody's interested, you put a deposit down, you get you get your picket of the pups. So. Nobody's picked anything yet. Nobody sent a deposit. So everybody is available except for the smoke one. So the smoke female is not available. I'm probably going to keep her. I'm holding on to her right now. I might sell her, but we'll see. I'm just want to, I don't want to put her out there until I see what she looks like later on. But the rest, all the rest, the other seven are for sale. And then I have, um, the pockets in the other room. Um, and I'm going to keep the blue one and sell the champagne a white one unless somebody comes at me with the right number for the blue one because I really because I don't have anything I, I can't breed this female anymore she's fixed so you know it's the only blood I have so unless they come with the right number they're not going to get the blue male but the champagne is just as nice um so let me let me show you what we got here and if if, if uh if uh, Beretta growls a little bit, don't get upset. She's just being protective. She's a little cuckoo about her. She's possessed about her food and her babies. Let's check. All right. It's okay, Mom. Trying not to disturb her because she's feeding. Look how big them puppies are, man. That blue's a monster. He's actually got like white tan ring length around him, but you can't really see it yet. So I'm sure as it gets old, probably be more pronounced. You can kind of see ghost stripes in there, but not really a lot of stuff. But right? I'm not trying to disturb her. Look at the size of that champagne, just as big. These puppies, these puppies ain't even three weeks old yet. Look at the size of them. They ain't even three weeks old. I think they're just turning three weeks old. I got to look at the calendar. I think they're two and a half or close to just turning three weeks. Yeah, I think they're just turning three weeks. So, a few couple days they will be. Yeah, but, uh, hey, Mama. She, she looks happy. So, that's them. And then we got. Zoom out of here a little bit. I got this shit so. Then I got the. Uh... Let me zoom in here. They're f these ones are feeding. And we got. I got a merle, it's kind of like a smoke merle, and then I got a smoke male, and then I got a smoke female. So I believe the smoke female is the one that's feeding right there. That's the, the smoke male is that one right there, and then that's like a smoke merle in the middle, and then you got the, the lilac female. And then here we go over here. What is this? Get my camera straight here. He's a bruiser, that one there. That one right there is a bruiser. Another bruiser is that brown. See that one under her leg? That one's a monster. She's being a good mama. She's eating good. She's getting plenty of meat. She's not eating that much kibble right now, but I spoil them when when they're having babies. I give them steak and chicken and supplements and all kinds of shit. So she's getting her new vet vitamins. She's getting meat. She's getting all the good stuff. Yep. Doing good, though. So like I said, I'm only keeping the smoke female at a this litter and the blue male out of the other litter. So you got the champagne pocket 
champagne away pocket, okay? Just know that bloodline on the mother's side is Gotti line, Dax line. Then on the father's side, you got Bully Barnes champion Joshua is the father of my, of my, so he's the grandfather of these puppies. He's the father of Little Rock. And then behind him is grand champion Samson. And then uh, here, the breeding here, we got Kobe, which goes back to the Bossies. Willy Wonka is his grandfather. Okay. Waka was his father. Waka that was here is his father. Okay. And then um, you got, I'm not sure. I got to look at the pedigree on the mother's side. I always forget the mother's side for some reason. She just didn't click in my head. I don't know why. I got to look at, double check it. But I'll let you guys know. I can't memorize all this shit. I'm so damn tired from me staying up all night. The last few nights I haven't slept worth the damn, so I'm a little stupid. And I have to go to work. So. But all seven, except for that smoke, all seven puppies are available. I've already given you the prices. I've already told you in the previous videos how it's going to work. If you're interested, just give me a call. It's 803-504-9447. You can pay up front and save money. Or you can pay um, a deposit and pay on it weekly or whenever you want. Or pick it up. Pay when you pick up. It has to be um, within 10 weeks. Or you lose your deposit. And I, I keep your money and I keep the dog. I, I can't keep these dogs. I don't have the facilities. You know, I've only got 11 runs, you know. So I can't I can't have dogs flying around all over the place. And I'm not putting any more kennels in my yard. This is as big as it's going to get until I move. Once I move, then I'm probably going to uh, sell these kennels or use them or whatever. I might just keep them and use them as surplus, you know. And eventually I'm going to build a metal building and everything's going to be self-contained, you know. AC, heat in the whole joint, drainage system, concrete floors. So I don't want to worry about the filing the nails down no more on that shit. So that's where we're headed. So like, comment, subscribe. Hope everybody has a good day. And I'll talk to you all later. Peace.